No, look, I, I just think it's important that, that we look good for the camera and, mm. you know, and, and if, if you do red next time, I think that'll be... I think red definitely is your rec- colour. Hang on, hang on, it's, it's recording. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. sorry, hello. Um, hi, 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 hi. My name is Stephen Eddy and welcome to Two Minute Tuesdays. Um, and Two Minute Tuesdays, today we are talking about an acid called... No, it's just folic acid. Folic acid or vitamin B9. And vitamin B9 is a group of folates together and they've got wicked names like folic acid. You've probably heard of that. Methyl tetrahydrofolate is another one. 510-methyl tetrahydrofolate. All these forms of folate, folinic acid, all these wonderful words. And they're all a group of folates. Now, you've probably heard of folic acid. That's the one you find in most synthetic supplements. And that's a very active one, but the body has to convert it to make it a natural folate in the body. And the enzyme, if you've only got two minutes, we'll, we'll say it very quickly, it's called methyl tetrahydrofolate reductase. And there's two types of these uh, genes. And what they do is they activate folic acid down to 5,10-methyl tetrahydrofolate. And that's the active form. That's the stuff you find in beautiful foods. Now, folate comes from the word foliage. So if you eat a lot of foliage like plants and vegetables and nuts and seeds and legumes, beans, those sorts of things, you're going to have lots of natural folates in your diet. Now, that's the best way to eat, of course, and natural folate is extraordinarily healthy for you. On the other hand, folic acid is a synthetic form of folate, and that's found in supplements, and they add it to, to grains and breads and all that sort of stuff. And you might be thinking, well, so what? What's the difference? What? Well, folic acid can have side effects. We know that super high doses of folic acid can cause problems in the body. It can interfere with certain medications like methotrexate, which is an anti-arthritic medication. It's also bad for rats. They've tried it on high amounts of rats. So of course, for you, it must be bad. So stick to the natural folates and thank you very much.